Donating money to your favorite streamer just to get recognition and then charging the money back afterwards is one of the worst things that you could possibly do to the streamer. Not just for the money, but it also causes PayPal to ice your account if you get enough of those chargebacks within a year. And they also launch a criminal investigation. And if things don't add up or if things look a little bit too weird to them, then it could also lead to your account getting shut down. Now, for some of you guys, maybe that doesn't matter because your PayPal account doesn't really mean much. So you can just make a new one onto the next one, right? But for content creators like myself and many others who suffer from a problem like this, it also fucks up our lives because everything that I do is through PayPal since it's the way I get paid. There's companies, organizations, businesses all around the world, monster size that utilize PayPal for industries purposes like this. But I'm a content creator individual, so therefore I don't have the connections or the leads or the abilities or, or, or the benefits that these big companies do. So even though I'm using it the same way they do, I get fucked in the ass if something like this happens to me. Now, for instance, if I want to go apply for a place for a new apartment, they're going to want to look at income history. I can use my PayPal to do that. But if my PayPal shut down and they can't get an inquiry from it then that fucks up my ability to live life as an adult in the united states or in the world in general that fucks up a lot of opportunities for me so fuck the money and if you want to talk about the money though for every individual chargeback case paypal adds an additional twenty dollars to how much they take away from you because of the processing so if someone donates five dollars five dollars five dollars and chargebacks all three of those transactions not only does paypal take away the five dollars each 15 but they also take away twenty dollars processing for the chargeback so you wind up up spending an additional $60 just for the fact that those cases were made. This is a problem. And even though my account hasn't gotten shut down from it yet, I know plenty of content creators whose lives have been fucked up thanks to these chargebacks. I don't even know if some of you guys have seen that video that I made where I ranted about this from people who charged me back earlier this year. And it was so frustrating because not only does it fuck up my life in terms of my credit, my income report, and also my money, but it also fucks up my potential chances to get special contracts with PayPal. I have certain deals in place with PayPal. These dudes, they see that I have a constant stream of income and they give me benefits that I can utilize for the sake of maintaining myself, my channel, and other people that I support in my life. So therefore, it fucks me up in so many ways with PayPal themselves. After those last chargebacks, even though I made the video and I talked about it and I expressed how upset I was and the people who did the chargebacks saw it and they apologized, they still went through with the chargebacks. What what the fuck? So after that, I called up PayPal and I stayed on the phone with them for hours. I think it was like two and a half hours. I was just talking to whoever the hell I could, trying to make my way up to the management as best as possible to ensure that I spoke to someone who had some kind of power to make some kind of influence on these kinds of situations. I spent a lot of time talking to them. Eventually, once I really got my stuff out and a lot of people heard me out, they said, all right, you know what? We got you. That was it. The last stream that I did, literally the Nintendo E3 one, Someone donated a lot of money. The dude's name was Chan Demand, and he had donated so much money in such a short time span that it made me feel a little uncomfortable because one, I've never seen his name before. So I was even saying in the stream that I hope this guy doesn't charge me back, but I'm not going to just let the negative experiences that I had before influence how I feel about this generosity from you now. Thank you. I appreciate it. I responded to every single one of his donations. Not that I even have to, because if you're donating, you're donating for the sake of supporting the content creator or the organization or the, or the effort. One way or another, it doesn't matter if you get recognition for it or not. You're donating because you want to donate, you want to support, you want to make sure that the money that you're giving goes towards helping that person out. So recognition, one way or another, is not the most important attribute. But you know, I tend to recognize people who donate, so whatever. And sure enough, after that stream, a couple days after, as you can see, he charged me back almost every single donation that he threw at me. So fuck me. Due to all the chargebacks that I had within the last year, this was looking like it was going to be game over. I had even gone out of my way to email Chandaman and ask him specifically, are you really charging me back for all of these donations that you threw at me with such generous, kind-hearted messages? Is this really going down or not? And they responded with one of the most cold-hearted, completely unattached responses ever. Oh. This wasn't an authorized transaction, so I'm not going to allow these things to go through. I'm charging back. I need my money back. So now I have to bend over and take it up the ass once again, thanks to some asshole who doesn't understand the meaning of a donation. Well, I got an email yesterday informing me about how those cases got resolved, and fuck me, it's a doozy. Hello, Desmond Amofa. We've completed our investigation of the transaction below and were unable to find evidence of unauthorized access to the buyer's account. 
The case was denied to the buyer and no funds were recovered from your account. I have one thing to say to you, Chan the Man, and any other piece of human trash that's done this to some other streamer before. GET FUCKED! Finally, PayPal is on our side. I can't speak for other content creators, but at least with me, thank God they finally acknowledge our presence as streamers and how vulnerable we are to horrible, malicious, fucked up attacks like this. They denied every single case that that scumbag tried to go against me with with the chargeback shit and were like, yo, Edipus good, man. He ain't do shit wrong. There ain't nothing wrong with this transaction. Guess what? You donated the shit. You gave it to him as a show of support. You're going to have to deal with the fact that you spent that much money. Nobody told you to click the pay now button, bitch. I don't care if it was a fucking adult. I don't care if it was a little fucking kid. One way or another, you're getting your just desserts. Because even if it was some 12-year-old kid, what the fuck are you doing spending your parents' cash like that anyways, you little fucking brat? Sit the fuck down, be humble, and stop trying to take advantage of niggas, all right? I'm not one for violence against kids, but if I had done this kind of a thing with my mom's money if I was younger, I would have been killed, my nigga. I mean, I'm kind of over-exaggerating there, but my mom would have beat my ass if I was a little brat doing this kind of shit. So, all I'm saying is that I don't understand what the hell comes into your little ass mind to be able to do some shit like that. You understand exactly what you're doing. You know it's fucked up, but you do it anyways because you just want the recognition in the moment. Then when your parents find out that you donated that much, you just try to charge the shit back. Well, you know what, dumbass? Maybe you fucking parents shouldn't be giving your kids access to your PayPal account or your credit or debit cards anyway so they can do some dumb shit like this in the first place. There's so many leagues of where the problem starts way before it gets to the streamer, way before it gets to the PayPal. Be a good parent. How about that? Make sure that your fucking brat doesn't have access to your money but you know what that motherfucker chan one way or another he got fucked in the ass and paypal is going to ensure that from now on i never get fucked like that again so this is a message that goes out to any single other person who had ever even thought about trying to just do a donation get me to recognize them thank them be the monster to show them love in the stream and then charge me back afterwards and anyone that ever did that to me or plans on doing it in the future try me bitch try to fuck with me you really want to try me Try me! Come at me now! There's no fucking joking around here! There's no memes, there's no trolling, there's no triggering, there's no nothing because now you see PayPal's fucking with me now! So you try to fuck with me, I fuck with you! Come get fucked if you really want to! Come test me on my stream! Come try to fuck my life up! Thank you for tuning in. This is a small message. Take care of yourselves. Have a good one. And SUCK MY DICK!